Bullet Club for, 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 for life. What's up fans, this is Lennox Kuna here, and I've been invited to join in Tony Pizza Guy's live uh, Fastlane Prediction Chat to uh, discuss, um, even though this Sunday is, uh, hold on, excuse me, pretty well. Yeah, let's go ahead and, that's the mods, alright, let's go ahead and get him in the call here, die Roman, die, let's hear what you got to say. Always entertaining, always controversial, but always Die, white. Die, 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 Danger said Roman, Roman Reigns is the best Roman wrestler Reigns that has match. walked on this planet. Well, that's not your typical Pizza Doc Mott two said Brad Spencer. Welcome, to Tony <laughs> Pizza Guy. Can you Have tell everybody time before here, we start this what your original Discord name was? Matty said X D D D D. Memorize said I can talk now. No. And Danger said I love Brad. Other Roman Reigns when you had before. Memorize said B T W. Oh, Roman Reigns. Yeah, that's exactly what his Discord was. Uh, can you that, I'm everybody? just waiting in line so I that way I can chat with Tom Kushan and Tony Pizza Guy to discuss about uh, the predictions to for tomorrow night's WWE Fastlane, <laughs> represented <laughs> by <laughs> the <laughs> Raw brand. You know, it's going to be awesome. For the first time, Goldberg gets to... Uh, his, to compete think, for a title match he haven't deserved since he left the WWE it, 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 like in 2004. A, the, the Goldberg Cena, takes on like Kevin Owens for the WWE Universal well, Champion. Even the best though I like Goldberg, Goldberg will be bound to SmackDown, bro, if he face if he face Bray Wyatt for the WWE World Champion anyway. Plus, also some more upcoming matches. Samoa Joe versus. Let me ask you though. Let's say that you more upcoming matches, as I was saying. Like Samoa Joe takes on like, Sami Zayn. Like, okay, These two former indie wrestlers have a lot of history back in Ring of Honor, and also, and also, also Bailey takes on Charlotte. For the for her WWE Women's title at Fastlane for the third time or fifth time, because I cannot remember how many times Bailey and Charlotte face each other. I think he's alright. Yeah, I think the character gets X Pac from me, as far as I'm concerned. He gets X Pac. Is that what you're saying? Yes, he gets X Pac from me every time. Channel change, he basically. Hmm. Hey, Candy Powers is not happy with you, mate. I just got sick of seeing him on uh, TV. I got sick of seeing his character. Ooh. But he, was he alright as the powerhouse of the Shield? Definitely. Because he never talked. Move him from the Shield. I just hated him. So then, what? Okay, let, let's say, like, Braun Strowman, Roman Reigns. You obviously want Braun Strowman to win then? I honestly. I'm not gonna even watch the match. I hate both of them. Really, you're not a Braun Strowman fan either. No, and thank God they, they aren't gonna do the Taker Strowman match. Cause to quote Dave Belcher, if I will, that match will be get a minus five stars. What do you think though? What do you think though? There there is rumors going that that Roman's gonna take on Taker at Mania, and Taker's gonna interfere in this match. What do you think of all of that? If Roman doesn't turn heel, there'll be a fan riot at Mania. I'm calling it right now. I don't see any reason why they would turn Roman heel. I mean, um, Dude, there's no real that, motive behind turning Undertaker. Roman Reigns heel. Yeah, that, it's the freaking Undertaker you're talking about, though. Roman's going to be the crowd-designated heel anyway. Wait, he already is. Yes, but Roman Reigns... <laughs> thought, what, do you, what, do you think of the, what do you think of WrestleMania with Roman Reigns' daughter crying? Does that not tug at your heartstrings a little bit? It does. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I was just trolling there, but. Styles vs. Undertaker. Styles vs. Undertaker. Think about it. You have a seasoned veteran like The Undertaker, and the 
arguably the best worker in the world in AJ Styles. Proof AJ's the best. Be I agree. Match could be a phenomenal match. Hell no yeah. Yes, but that's not It's gonna way happen, better than AJ Styles with so his Shane Sorry, McMahon so match. Good. Trust me. <sighs> Fucking Why? trust me, it's better than AJ Styles with his Shane Why? McMahon. Why? 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 He was red hot throughout last year. Seriously, who likes this? Who likes this shit? <laughs> okay, here's what. Here, let's <laughs> jump over to SmackDown real quick. So I can tell you what why what the motive is here. AJ Styles is getting screwed AJ out of his Styles. championship opportunities over and over and over. Again. Exactly. Thanks to freaking Shane McMahon and, and Daniel Bryan. And, and yes, yet, you know AJ what? Event, Once I talk to Tony Pizza guy, there's something that I want to get off my chest though about this whole AJ Styles keep getting screwed though. Because I talked to my friend Joe on Instagram. You know, I mean, I mean AJ. Styles beat Luke Harper not once but twice to keep his main event spot to face Bray Wyatt for the WWE title at WrestleMania. And now Randy Orton who won the Raw Rumble. True. Yeah, but look at the wrestling styles of Shane again. What did somebody say? Somebody said he does baby jabs and Exactly. What Shane does is fake. True, tell Unless him. Unless they pull out like a Kurt Angle type match out of it. it's going to be insane. I mean, what yeah, Shane does in that still, ring I mean, is fake, though. Like, trust me, in the main event with, I've been watching because, Shane yeah, yeah, fighting that ring for like anyways, six years since I've been watching WWE. Anyway. I watch how Shane fights in the ring. From Believe me. TNA, hello? True, true. Tell him die, Roman right. die. Tell we're gonna, him. We're going to end you here. Any final thoughts? Die, Roman die. We'll, we'll get some more people on the call. I'm thrilled at the prospect of broken Matt Hardy coming to the WWE. <laughs> oh, why it's not broken Hardy's people would be awesome. Oh. All, <laughs> All right, but there is no Wyatt family anymore, so we'll have to. Oh, no, Ray no Ray more Roman Wyatt Hardy family then. since Randy Orton you know, now decides to Rowan, face too, Randy Orton since he won account. This year's Royal Rumble, and yeah, then so the night after Elimination so Chamber we'll match, see, after he retained his WWE World anyway, title Dyrum, Dyrum, against you for AJ in, and John Cena, Randy Orton now said, "Oh, Bray Wyatt, I prove right, that I have nothing Dyrum to prove to you. I won't face Randy. I won't face at WrestleMania 33 for the WWE title. That's freaking bullshit, man." Bullshit. He needs to find Jesus or something. Seriously. I mean, you won the Royal right, Rumble match. On now it's on you too uh, scared to next. face Bray Wyatt. Dyer, Unless all of a sudden, since the now. Wyatt family has been uh, torn apart, now it's on you decide to turn your back on them by burning the Wyatt compound. Wow. That's great. Die, Roman. Die. So me, he's called Roman is great. said no one ever. Roman is great, though. I will tell you that much. What the hell, Tony? Right, Matty Ice already got in here. Die Roman Die got in. Who's next in line? Is anybody using the full caps fast lane now? I don't see anybody that wants to get in the call. All you gotta do is type it in there. Because Discord is just so complicated. Ah, it's good. It's easy. Hmm. Ant Danger's typing a lot. Uh, Adam where, typing. Why are you seeing this, by the way? There's a text channel as well. I'm so confused. I'm going down the line here. Nobody's typing die, oh. Roman, die. Oh. Or not die, Roman, die. Uh, hashtag, uh... Anybody? 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 Yeah, that, me that memorized guy. Oh, uh, he, is he is he good to talk now? Let's see if he talks now. He's not... He's just muted himself. He's, he's good to talk. Memorized. Wait, the Pickle you? Man. Where's he going? Oh, there he is. There he is. Memorized, are you there? Yeah, hello. There he is. Finally got it figured out. Yeah, well, I was a bit busy before. But Fellow right Britishman. Now. Yep. <laughs> Whereabouts are you from? Uh, Hampshire. Yeah, uh, do you know what that is? No. <laughs> it's a county. It's a whole county. All right, let's move this along, Tom Grisney. All right, whatever. Yep. No, <laughs> he doesn't know where you're from, apparently. Um, so, we got Fastlane going on. We just had Roman Reigns pin Braun Strowman. We got a bunch of cool stuff going on on this show. Uh, anything in particular that gets you excited, memorized, he just muted himself again. Alright. He gone? Well, he 
he's gone. Oh, he left and. Are you are you there, Memorax? Right. Are you there? Hello? Memorized. Because I'm suppressed. I'm suppressed. Are you there? I can hear Hello, you. Hello, now I can talk. There you go. Yeah, you're good. It so, just came uh, out and I'm suppressed, but yeah. No, you're good. Is there anything you want to talk about about Fastlane? We have uh, a big ooh. open discussion right now. We just saw Roman and Braun. Roman wins, obviously, LOL. Anything you want to chat about? Uh, it's the main event that I'm really, like, skeptic about, honestly, because... There's not really much they can do without either making Kevin Owens look like an idiot or making Goldberg just look weak again. Or, I say again, at the beginning. I'm not really sure how they're going to end that match unless they're going to do it really quickly or draw it out and then make his feud with Brock Lesnar make no sense. I just, I don't understand how they're going to do that match. Um, you, you, you definitely need interference in this match to make it, uh, if you have, like, if you have, uh, Brock come out and kick the crap out of Goldberg, and then Kevin Owens just takes over for a while, because he, you know, if, if Brock Lesnar f 5 Goldberg through an announce table or something, then that would give reason to why Kevin Owens would have a lot of offense, you know? I get that, but I don't, I'm worried they're just going to, like, they're going to do that, but they're not going to do it quickly. They're going to have a, a bit of a match first and then do it. Or they're going to have Jericho come out first or something, which... Yeah. Probably gonna like, have, like, I'm just tapping, I'm just typing, like, so I've been, been silent like the whole time. I'm just you, listening, well, yeah, listening in into that, the conversation. Make Jericho come out and stop him from doing that. Yeah, which, some I don't know where they're gonna go with that. Without, without, there's, there's gonna be like the ending is gonna be interference. The beginning is gonna be like Kevin Owens being scared, but it's what they're gonna do in the middle that I haven't, I'm really confused about the way they've set this up. Well, you've seen like the the Kevin Owens matches. They're mostly him cheating and him trying to be a coward and. Uh, Jericho usually gets interferes and helps him do a bunch of damage, but that's not going to happen this time. Kevin Owens is actually going to have to fight Goldberg. Um, really, though, like it is concerning, though, what they're going to do here. Do you do you pull the trigger and give Goldberg the championship? I do not want to see Goldberg with the title at all because I just don't think like if you've given it to him, there's no way you're going to take it off him without making whoever takes it off of him look like the strongest guy in the world, which then means when he gets beaten, it's just gonna look weird and also he's you know he's not exactly he's, he's he's getting old he is old there's not much he's gonna be able to do with newer guys that's gonna be very interesting after this Brock Lesnar thing that's my worry with Goldberg is that he sort of finished everything yeah, he can do that's interesting yeah. after this feud so I guess do you just uh, have Goldberg lose to Brock at Mania and then Brock is champion is that what you do, do they I honestly wouldn't have to fight for the title at Mania I just, just have to have a, but then the I guess you kind of have to have a little bit more of a match though, right? Like it's got to there's got to be something different than their regular other matches, right? Yeah, but uh, it's just I I wouldn't have a uh, goal after Mania. I would not have Goldberg with the title because if if I had to do one of them, I'd give it to Brock just because Goldberg is he uh, what was he did when he first came back? He almost injured himself by throwing around security guards. He's not he's old. He can't do a lot, especially with the new guys that will actually be interesting. I just don't think he's got much of a gimmick after this feud. The only reason people really are that interested right now with his matches is because Brock Lesnar's getting involved and they because of the whole speculation with the Mania match. After that, I'm not really sure what. There's no real reason to be invested in it. I think the WrestleMania is the end for Bill Goldberg, right? <laughs> I don't really like to sound like <laughs> really horrible to him here, but I sort of hope so. Because Career versus it should title. be. I really don't understand. Unless they do like Undertaker Goldberg, but is that even anything we want to see either? That sounds so <laughs> shit. It, it does. It's just like two old people in a ring trying to not kill themselves with every single like spot. That's what that sounds like. <laughs> but but I, I just don't. I just don't understand. Like okay. Do you have Brock be champion then? I don't I don't know. I think they sort of set this up thinking it's going to go really well and then not really thought about it in the long run is what's happened. Because they're running out of places to go afterwards. That's the, only, that's the bit I really don't understand is what they're going to do afterwards. One of them has the title. No matter what happens now, the, whoever wins this is going to look strong as hell. And then they're going to have to interview with someone else who's not looking as strong as hell. And then there's just not going to be any reality to it because someone's been beating the strongest guy in the company and the other guy is just not looking strong at all. 
I guess the only way to make it look good is not have Goldberg win the title, have Brock interfere and That's cost the Goldberg the championship. That's all I can think of there. Yeah, it's got to be, especially with Fastlane, it's got to be a screwy finish. There's no way they can do this clean and then keep. Uh, but I will say, bad. like, what if Stone Cold Steve that Austin ref like Brock a... and Goldberg at WrestleMania? How awesome would that be? That's pretty sad. Uh, oh, um, it went well last time. It went really well last time. But, yeah, uh, no. <laughs> I think Brock's around for the long haul, but I don't know about Goldberg. Because I think Brock, he, he fi- officially retired from UFC followed that at all he's done fighting he's, he's done with that stint so he's only i guess he's only a wwe star now so i think brock's around but i don't know about goldberg goldberg can't be there for much longer anyway like even if he wanted to he's not like because otherwise he's going to the point we're having the worst matches possible it's like the undertaker who it's amazing he can still do as much as he can but at some point he's gonna have to stop and it's not he can't be like a million miles away which is what I'm not, I don't know, I'm not even sure this is going to be his last WrestleMania, which is what scares me. Is I want it to be his last WrestleMania, but then I don't even know who he's going to be facing. The brand split has really made Undertaker's like last opponent really weird, considering he's only now got a limited amount of people to go up against, unless they do some sort of like inter-brand thing. Well, but if, even you, if you listen weird. to The Undertaker, he says, I am bigger than any brand, I can do what I want, I'm The Undertaker, so. But then that just sort of like devalues the entire brand split. Well, he is the Undertaker, so try to stop him. <laughs> Fair point. Pretty much. That <laughs> is Undertaker thinking, like, retires. If you want to keep Brock around uh, or Goldberg around, you need to do some sort of post WrestleMania draft thing where you can trade and stuff. And I think you put Brock on one show. If you keep Brock and Goldberg around, you Brock on one show, Goldberg on another show. And what an interesting turn of events here. Nia Jax uses a weapon and gets herself disqualified against Sasha Banks. How cool was that? That was not cool. That was pretty sweet. That's It'd be cool. great cool if it happened the other way around in real life, actually. I like that. I like All right, we're going to get some more people in here. we got a lot of people in the queue. Is there anything else you want to talk about before? Uh, we... uh, no, nah, I'm fine. All right, thanks, thanks for calling in. I appreciate yeah. it. All right, Kushni. What do you think of that? What do you think of Nia Jax using a weapon against Sasha? I'm just, I'm disgusted to be honest. She didn't need to do that. I think it was great. I think it was awesome. Let's go ahead and do our women's match here: Bailey and Charlotte. Bailey. Ooh. Oh man, who is going to win this match? It's obviously going to be Charlotte. Bailey. Yeah, I think so. Bailey. She was Charlotte. Bailey wins. Bailey I really Charlotte. think they should have just kept the title Bailey off Bailey and Charlotte. Mania. She's going to be Bailey a six feet tall. Charlotte. Bailey Actually, to Charlotte. <laughs> they should have kept the title off. Bailey they should have just kept the title off Bailey, Bailey the wants some Bailey Like what the bloody hell Why Bailey did they have her win the title Bailey. I should have given her a moment at I WrestleMania I was a WrestleMania movie in the making But What the hell were they thinking I just feel like That is pretty good though I feel like WWE is losing sight of their what they're doing, and they're like, "Well, she can't lose at a pay per view, so we have to make her lose at Raw." And I think it's so stupid. It's like she has like say special say powers when she's on pay Yeah, say. I don't get it. Charlotte's pretty awesome. It, but we got Bailey and we got Charlotte going up here, I one say. on one for the women's championship. It's cool to see Bailey with that title, but Bailey. I would have rather her had a WrestleMania moment. Mate, have you downloaded a custom attire? No, I've not. No, that's okay. Oh, my God. It's all right. We don't need to do that. Let's get the next person in here. Pickle Man is on the queue here. Let's get Pickle, oh, Pickle Man, Man. Here. The Pickle Man. The Pickle Man. How's it going? How's it going, guys? He's here. So we're, we're just Hello. in here chatting about Fastlane. We got Charlotte and Bailey. Yes. I guess we'll focus the discussion on that. Uh, what do you think of Bailey? What do you think her chances are of retaining the title? Uh, 50-50. Do you think Sh- that, 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 that Charlotte has special powers going into the, the pay-per-views and she is a... Uh, definitely has special powers. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Undertaker just gave her her power, his uh, mania powers. <laughs> <laughs> what? Undertaker so gave Charlotte, Charlotte her? Since when did What? My prediction is Fatal 4-Way what? with Bailey, Charlotte, yes. Sasha, and Nia. Yes, me too. Um, so, I f- so I felt like they'll either have Charlotte gave win Charlotte, and then, take and then gave super Charlotte after her powers, Fastlane, so she have maybe, maybe Sasha Charlotte come out like the female out and Undertaker after that match of course huh? and uh, maybe do something like, like Nia takes them all out or something 
Right, right, right. I don't know. I think what you do is you have, like, my thing is that I think Charlotte should win here because she's got that pay-per-view power or whatever we want to call it. <laughs> and then I think Mania in the four-way, she can lose, but she won't have to get pinned, you know? So then she could be like, oh, yeah, I never got pinned in a match. What do you What do you think of Nia Jax, by the way? I like Nia, I like Nia Jax. You like Nia Jax? Yes. Well, I think she sucks. Like, I mean, she's just not great. She's not like most girls. <laughs> <laughs> All right, get out. Don't come back. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, but yeah, she is. She's good. Uh, do you think that like she's gonna go over Sasha so that she can look like a contender for that championship? Prob- probably. Yeah, but mate, Sasha Banks is gonna turn heel. Well, they, well, they can they can do that after Mania. They can do that's, that after Mania. If you can turn on Daily. Yeah, that too. That too. They can do that. They can do that. There's an. I have another theory that for some reason I feel like they want to set up Sasha Stephanie. I don't know why I think that, but I, I want to see that. To be fair, well, like We're gonna they, might, they might just do a at WrestleMania. Come on, guys. I, they might just do a triple threat with Nia Bailey and Charlotte and do Sasha Stephanie. I don't hey, know. Yard in there. Yard's not even on. It's fine. He's not in the call. That's fine. All right. So, uh, other than that, we, we talked about the women's division. What do you think about the main event, though? We got KO versus Goldberg. How is that one playing out? Uh, see, I've been going back and forth. I don't. I think I'll, I'll say Goldberg, but I wouldn't mind Kevin Owens winning. Like either one, I, I wouldn't mind winning. So I'll say I'll, I'll go with Goldberg, but. Okay, let's There's look at let's just look at WrestleMania as what it is because in recent years WrestleMania has just been uh, let's make the most obvious card or most fan favorite card or most casual wrestling fan card so that everybody and their mom can watch WrestleMania and know what's going on. So do you think Goldberg would be that champion? I don't think that because he will people know Goldberg, but not everybody knows Kevin Owens, right? So I didn't think Goldberg right. as far as WrestleMania because you have to look at WrestleMania as its own show now. Before it was like. Okay, we'll finish storylines. We'll lead up to rest. We'll lead up to the next Raw. But now it's just like WrestleMania is its own encapsulated thing from that time it starts till it ends. It's like you'll get Mick Foley, Stone Cold, The Rock, all these people that come back just because it's a big event. So WrestleMania, know, like, WrestleMania is to appeal to the casual fans so they can subscribe to the network. Right, right. I think what you do, like as, as much as people hate this. I think that you put the big names in the main events right. that'll draw people in, and then you put the undercard as, like, the guys who are going to work their ass off and keep people watching. Like, kind of the WCW mentality where you put all the names in the main event that don't have that great of matches, but they're still decent, and then you put all the good matches on the mid-card. Right. I think that's the way WrestleMania is going to work this year. But yeah, um, and then we have like uh, the cruiserweight match. Are you excited? Yes, for the you yes I am. Yes, I you... am. Are you a Gallagher fan? I like I like Neville and Gallagher. Who isn't a Gallagher fan at this point? Who isn't a Gallagher fan? Mate, do you know what I want to see? I want to see Neville go for a red arrow whilst holding the umbrella. That would be fucking insane. <laughs> 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 like, I reckon he could pull it off. So yeah, I'm what... actually. I'm... What do you think is going to be at WrestleMania then? Do you think we're going to get a multi-man cruiserweight ladder match? Is that the way they're going? I I wouldn't mind that. Or maybe since Austin Aries is uh, debuting soon, maybe him and Neville. All right, that would totally steal the show. That would that be awesome. awesome. Yeah. Former TNA or just, Ring of Honor World Champion with, uh, versus TJ the Burke. current just cruiserweight get champion. Get him off my TV, that would be spicy. Whoa, come on. Yeah. You know, like, TJ I do not like TJ Perkins. Hey, we want some Bailey. Hey, yeah, we want some Bailey. Yeah, that's probably the only good thing about him. All right, say, final, final, final thoughts here. We got to get someone else in here. We got a lot of people. Yes. Sorry, don't I'm mean to cut you coming up next. Anything else no problem. Want to do? Coming up next. Talk about before we. Coming up next. Uh, uh, coming up uh, next. I think. Uh, uh, coming up I think next. Think Samoa Joe, same as anyone, will be matched of the night. I think coming so too. Next. Any any social media you want to pick next. out? YouTube, Facebook. Coming up no. next. Amazon Prime. Coming up next. Uh, <laughs> coming up next. Tumblr. No, coming no, up, good. Coming up, coming up, Blogs coming up TV. next. No, okay. All right, coming thanks for calling next. in. Appreciate it. No All right, Cushy, there it is. Match of the night. Sami Zayn, yeah. Joe, again. 
Is that any surprise? Nah, man, it's gonna be fucking amazing. Tom Cushion. Wait, have we talked about that match yet? I, th I think we have, right? Yeah, thing. that was the first one we died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've talked about that. Well, what else is to go? Because I, I remember. No, that's right. We're, we're coming down here. We're winding down here. Let's just get some people in here. We got It's Owen next in line. It's Owen, I believe. Okay, so I we've got, we've got like, uh, we talk, yeah, we've got like, wait, we've got one more match. match. Yeah, we got the main event. Well, we, we didn't do the tag match, and we didn't, who cares? And then we didn't do the cruiserweight match, who cares? We'll do the main event after this. But we'll, uh, we'll get, who's next in line? Where's Pickle Man? We gotta find him. We just have Pickle Man. I know, but I'm trying to find out who was right after Pickle Man in the call queue. Uh, I can't remember. I think it's this it guy. It's Tidy Chris, Chris J. Yeah, yeah, I think it's Tidy Chris. All right, let's let's add him in here. Tidy Chris, how's it there going? Is. There he is. Ty D, how's it going? Are you there? Mate, he's Hello? definitely there. Ty D? Oh, you got a little camera shy there. He's dead. He's, no, he, he's definitely dead. Oh, this is Ant Danger. Ant Danger, get in here and talk. Hello? Ant Danger. Mate, he's oh, there. Oh, are you there? Oh, you fucked it up, mate. Hello? Hello? How's there it going? I hear you. I can barely hear you. Why are you so quiet? Um, the champ oh, I can hear. is Can you turn your volume up a little bit? Oh, the God. champ is here. I might sell this on eBay one Are you day. There? You better? You get good? some cash and trade it in. Yeah, you're a little quiet. For we'll a go WWE with it. All right, so fast lane. Any World title you want to talk about real quick? Uh, if any I'm match in particular one. that strike fancies you or whatever I want to say? I don't know what word I'm looking for. No, not really. Do you even care about fast lane? Are you excited for SmackDown Live with AJ and Orton? SmackDown Live. AJ's gonna right. win. AJ's going that, to right. the main event of WrestleMania hands down. Oh, so okay. WWE right. needs well, to start pushing AJ Styles to, to main event status. Yeah. So I'm gonna tell all I'm gonna talk right, to this AJ oh, Styles. That's fine. You can listen. All main you event next WrestleMania. On the line, I think we got the. Who is the next? You're gonna have to find him. Uh, let's have a look. I think it was It's Owen. Let's go with It's Owen. Oh, yeah, I reckon it's It's Owen. It's Owen, you're on the line. How's it going? Period. Still got his mic muted. It's Owen, you're on the oh, line. Oh, he's got me. He got scared. Oh, God. All right. Oh, yep, here he is. He's back, he's back. All right, let's, let's add him in here. It's Owen, are you there? Hello. There hey, he is. what's going on, man? Hi. All right, so we got Vaseline going on. And I've got to ask you, what are your predictions for the the pay per view? What what matches are you looking forward to? All right, <laughs> he comes back in. I think I heard his mom in the background or something. <laughs> Maybe his tea's ready or something. Which is fine. All right, let's go. Uh, who's next on the call list here? We got Die Roman Die. We got him in here. We got them. Uh, who else is left? Say the I reckon L you should word. just do it randomly. Like, Say the L random. word. Swear, you got fair. Let's go with Lennox. This dude yes! Trip. I met him in New York for SummerSlam. That's right, yeah, Tony let's, Pizza let's go. Oh, Tony, guy. Are you going to WrestleMania? Lennox. Lennox. No, I, I currently do not have tickets for WrestleMania, but... Hold on. Can you unmute oh, my mic, Lennox, man? are you there? Hello, yeah, hello. Like I know you. You're the cool cat who likes AJ Styles. Yo, what's up, Tony Pizza Holy Guy? Shit. The champ is mother freaking here. The champ that runs the camp who will be voted for AJ Styles Tuesday night to main event WrestleMania. And boy, I got something to tell you to get on my chest, man. What's up, Tom Kushan? How you doing? This I know I know you and I haven't met face to face, but how you doing? Hey, you have more charisma than Roman Reigns. I like it. Yeah, yeah. At least Roman Reigns doesn't have charisma. I do. I mean, <laughs> you definitely do. I All mean, right, Lennox. okay. Lennox, we got Fast Lane coming up. What do you think about the whole show? Oh, Fast Lane! I am so pumped for Goldberg. I mean, it's been like what since two thousand four. Goldberg never got a title shot. I mean, I just hope he kicked Kevin Owens' fat ass at Fast Lane to be Universal Champion because. The point is, Jericho is not going to be at ringside. Since Kevin Owens turned his back on Chris Jericho, Kevin's going to do it on his own. I guess Triple H's words must have 
May Kevin Owens turn on Jericho, that could be it. He's probably creating a new stable along with Samoa Joe. You got Kevin Owens, Samoa Joe in the same stable? Can't handle that many big guys. I don't know what Triple H likes in fast way, people. <laughs> I'm just hey, look joking. Bray Wyatt's champion on SmackDown, Kevin Owens champion on Raw, and then you got Samoa Joe as best friends right now with Triple H. Come on, he likes the big dudes. I know, what can I say? Triple H like big dudes. And not to mention, I just hope Sami Zayn... Look, I have tremendous respect of Samoa Joe because just like him, AJ Styles, Kazarian, and Christopher Daniels, they've been wrestling all around the world while they were in TNA. Trust me, they represent pro wrestlings while other don't represent pro wrestling, okay? Okay, WWE don't know pro wrestling, okay? I know pro wrestling because there's more to it than just sports entertainment. I'm not trying to shoot on WWE. I just like WWE because it is. Besides the sports entertainment, I just see it as pro wrestling. That's it, plain and simple. All right, fast lane. Bailey won. Bailey, Bailey won. Bailey won. She did win. What do you think about the women's division at Fastlane? Oh, the women's division is going to blow my mind. I mean, it's about time they got Bailey as Raw Women's Champion. Stephanie says to Bailey, like, oh, you're not good enough to be Women's Champion. But Bailey proved <laughs> Steph wrong. She proved Charlotte wrong. And she did. Because two years ago at the Barclays Center when they did NXT Brooklyn me and my dad was there okay we were sitting at the top row and I saw Bailey beat Sasha Banks when the NXT Women's Champion me and the crowd were chanting Sasha Banks and the others were Bailey but it was a good match though so I say Bailey deserved this moment if she can hold on to that title she will be able to end Charlotte's pay-per-view streak and as for Samoa Joe and Sami Zayn well, as much as I like both guys, even though they both had their history in Ring of Honor, so I'm going to go with Joe on this one. So I don't care if he's a heel or a face. I just like Samoa Joe. And the one thing that bothers me is that AJ Styles has to face Randy Orton to secure his spot in the Royal Rumble Again, why is Shane McMahon screwing with AJ Styles? Because I saw your YouTube video, Tony Pizza, of Shane McMahon versus AJ Styles, WW2K17. Hope they don't put that in the WrestleMania match. I mean, what's the point of screwing AJ Styles? I mean, this guy has been all over the fucking world from TNA, Ring of Honor, New Japan. He has won all world championships there. I mean, except Ring of Honor, and now WWE. Why can't they just leave AJ Styles alone and let him face Bray Wyatt? Because I want to see a Bray versus AJ feud since Randy Orton is, is not man enough to face, to face Bray Wyatt since he won the Royal Rumble. I mean, come on, man. If you don't want to well, face Bray Wyatt. What do you think? Come on, time to pass. We'll have a little SmackDown talk here. What do you think of... Uh, like Luke Harper getting added into that match because if there's a Luke Harper, Bray Wyatt, um, Randy Orton match, triple threat without AJ Styles, is that going to make you angry? Hell yeah, because I'd rather see AJ Styles as WWE World Champion. I mean, if Shane McMahon, if WWE puts Shane McMahon the SmackDown Commission, I mean, let's face it, just like John Cena, Shane McMahon can't fight neither. I mean, they both have a lot of common. I mean, they're both fake. They're both entertainers. I mean, I watch Blitz Sports, okay? Bruce Blitz, I mean, that guy. You should watch that guy, Sports Channel. I mean, that guy hates John Cena just as much as I do. And a whole lot of anti-John Cena fans out there that don't like John Cena. Trust me. Believe me. Please, I believe you, man. I believe you. But, um... As far as fast lane goes here, we're gonna we're gonna get this call going. We're, we got to get a couple more people in here before we do end. All this right. Any, any final thoughts here, Lennox, about fast lane? I don't want to miss it, cause I just hope Goldberg wins. Cause if he does, we might see a Goldberg versus Brock Lesnar part three for the Universal Title. Who knows? And also to Tom Kushan, if you hear me, if you don't know me, you can. Uh, 
Go to, you can follow me at Twitter, at PhenomenalElco, Instagram, Lennox Coleman 5150 and also you can go to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I need more followers in order to keep my YouTube channel going, so um, it's nice to hear your voice, and thank you, Tony Pizza Guy, for inviting me here. So I'm looking forward to Fastlane tomorrow night, and it's going to be one hell of a show just to kick off WrestleMania. All right, thanks, Lennox, for joining. You hear that, Tom? What did he call you, Cushy? Yeah, he's not got he's not he's not got it right, but yeah. Uh, thank you, and thank you for joining me. I am the champ, Lennox Coleman, and thank you for participating. You have a good day. <laughs>